Hi everyone, in this week's video I'm going to be showing you the final product of the engine remote start kit I've been building. Uh, so if you're a new viewer, consider hitting that subscribe button down here and giving a thumbs up. And if you're a returning viewer, thanks for coming back. Also, hit that like button, it helps the channel. Now, let's crack on and I'll show you how to install this into your car. The final product, it's finished. Oh, nearly dropped it. So here it is. Small little box with five wires coming out of it. I've kept it simple. Color coded. There's three green wires, which two are for the AC and one is for the start. And you've got permanent 12 volt and your ground. So I'm going to show you briefly how to install it on a Mark III Mondeo. Um, for this kit to work, you will need to buy um, a bypass module for the immobilizer. There is a link in the description to one of those. Uh, so you'll have to sacrifice your spare key of some sort or a chip or go to a dealership where you can get another one made up. Um, I will say now, you know, if you get one of these, make one of these or buy one or whatever, don't leave your, ca your car in gear because it, it'll just jolt forwards or backwards, whichever you've left it, and it will crash your car. So I'm not liable if anyone does that. Uh, but with uh, all that said... I'm going to crack on, I'm going to install this and show you how to do it, what wires you need um, and we'll go from there and I'll show you it working and how to tidy this all up. There's your engine remote kit, ignore, ignore this piece because I've got a start stop button here and I've just unplugged the module to plug it into but you need to come underneath here and in this little wiring underneath the dash you need, let me swap hands with the camera, to find the green and blue wiring, the red wire, there's a yellow wire, which is an accessory wire, and also the grey wire here, and that's your crank wire, your start wire. So they're the, they're the one, two, three, four wires you need to tap into. Um, the fifth wire is a ground, and you can tap that into a ground or to the chassis of the car somewhere doesn't really matter where and like I said to bypass the the immobilizer around here what I've done is just for the purpose of this video I've pulled mine back down from where I hide it and I've done this with it I've got a second the second key I've got with the car I've taken the chip out of it attached it to here and taped it up and everything else look so but you can buy the module for that. There will be a link in the description. So you can leave that module up around here. But you will have to sacrifice that and for this to work. So I've tapped it all in. Okay. Where's my remote? It's just here. Okay, we'll do it again. And now we we'll turn it off again. So there it is guys, they're the wires you need to tap into for your engine remote start and stop. It is a little simple box with five wires. Obviously there's still things I could do to this to make it a little bit more, more better. Um, but for now, this is the basic and it does the job. Like I said, you will need um, a module to bypass the immobilizer. So you will have to sacrifice a second key or get it a chip copied. And you can buy the immobilizer module below. There's a link down there for that. Or you can just do it the way I've done it, as you see in the video. But you will have to sacrifice that. Don't start this car like this if it's in gear. Okay, just bear that in mind. The car will jolt forwards. Uh, but I've got to say this because there's always that one person that will try or forget. They will forget. Not purposely, but, you know, they will forget. Um, so that's it. 
that's the engine remote start stop that's the remote for it nice and simple easy install five wires is what it is so if you like my videos hit that subscribe button hit the like button thanks for viewing uh, thanks for being patient with what I've been building this it's taken a while to do that's how you install it into your Mark III Mondeo. I'm gonna now go and try on another car, uh, Vauxhall Severa. I'm gonna try on that and see if it works on there as well. Um, I will record the process of that to show you it does work on that car as well. But for now, thanks for watching. Over and out. Bye for now. Till next time.